Reserve Deputy Taylor Ford told me he always looked up to his dad, who retired from the Gretna Police Department's Reserve Division. And although his father passed away unexpectedly just before Tate graduated a year and a half ago, he's fulfilling that promise from a son to his father to answer the call of duty and then to do more. Had them after my For Jefferson Parish Reserve Deputy Tate LaFort, Thursday night's shift at Oakwood Mall was routine until his very last call. She was flustered to say the least. She was a little disappointed that someone would go so far as to take something out of a stroller. He's talking about Ava Hightower. The busy mother of five left her stroller with her purse and all of her shopping bags in the mall parking lot. And before she knew it, all that stuff and new shoes for 10 little feet were all gone. It really hits home when it's about the kids, right? So Deputy LaFord decided to do something extra, but he didn't know how. I didn't want to just hand her money. <laughs> I was able to ask her if it was okay if I were to purchase her children's shoes, which was, she, that's what she was truly heartbroken about. The cards and all that stuff, she was, she was able to replace later on. But her children's shoes that she had just bought for them, that's what she was really hurt about. So I wanted to be able to help her out in that way. Hightower knows what helping out means a lot more than most. See, she's only been a mom for two years, her family growing from four to seven overnight just in December when she and her husband took in three more children ages four, seven and nine from a family member. But Deputy LaFort didn't know all that. All he knew was that five kids needed shoes and he could give that to them. You just you step up where other people don't. LaFort, a reserve deputy, doesn't get a paycheck from the sheriff's department. He says he's just doing what he loves and giving more when he can. Because that's what it's all about. You're trying to make someone's day better than what they currently are. Because if they're calling the police, they're obviously not having a good day. And in case you're wondering, Deputy LaFort does not have kids of his own just yet. He says he's enjoying being a newlywed for now. Hightower says she's grateful for the deputy's generous gift and that all five kids are loving their new, new shoes. Jennifer Crockett, WDSU News. All right.